I'm Grant Owens at the Dream Hotel on Dash Radio, Dash X, and we're joined by the lovely Charlotte OC. Welcome Mm. to the studio. Thank you. The new single, Boyfriend, is out now. Go stream it everywhere. And uh, you absolutely blew us away live at South by Southwest. Just totally amazing. We're so excited to present you in a show. Uh Uh, So, you know, obviously, we're really excited about you. Do you enjoy performing a lot? Yeah, I love it. I think it's my favorite uh, bit of the whole process of being an artist, I guess. Um, I find being in a studio, I don't know, I find it a little bit strange and a little... um, it's quite intimidating, yeah, on stage. I find that the easiest uh, because it's the most raw. It's not about getting many takes. It's about that one, you know, moment of just conveying that emotion. So, yeah, I love performing. Mm-hmm. And connecting with fans as well, and you know. Well, yeah, you say that, but like, I don't really <laughs> connect with them because I'm not looking at them at all. Can't really like, see them, No, huh? but also, like, I choose not to look at them. And I think... Because if I did, it'd ruin the whole thing. Wow. So I'm, I may look like I am, but I'm always looking above them. So yeah. Interesting. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so South by Southwest, uh, that's where we saw you. What kind of experience is that? Because that's like so many performances in a row. Is that good for conditioning as a performer? Uh, it's weird. It was just like the, this year. I did it four years ago, and it was um, felt a little bit more hectic this year. It was still hectic, and everything that could go wrong probably did. But it, it but at mm-hmm. the same time, like the crowds at South by are just like a different league compared to any other crowd, really. Like it's like yeah. I've never really witnessed uh, that um, that enthusiasm for music. Like they just loved it, right. and um, yeah, it, it it's quite a beneficial thing to do as an artist. I think I, after I did it the first time, I was like, I'm never doing it again. I'm so glad I did it again. That's it, awesome. Like, and you knew what to expect, sort of. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> like, my manager didn't know, and I was trying to warn her. I was like, seriously, mate, like this is going to be, um, this Marathon. Is gonna be an experience. <laughs> oh, yeah, I don't think she knew at all. But um, yeah, I loved it. I loved it. Well, Charlotte, let's talk about your sound. Some people may not have heard you yet. Describe the sound and some of the influences in your sound. Um, I don't know, really. A lot of the stuff that I'm influenced by isn't necessarily what my music sounds like. Like, I, I love electronic music and I love, um, like, Marabou State and yeah. Porter's Head and uh, Talking Heads. Um, but then there's also the soul stuff that I grew up listening with, like, Aretha Franklin and... Um, I'm not sure. I, I also grew up listening to a lot of folk music with like James Taylor and John Martin. But, and I think my stuff has got a slight Americana sound to it. Um, slightly haunting. Um, there's a little bit of an ele- electronic element, but it's all based around what I'm kind of saying and this big vocal and I don't know. Mm-hmm. It's just, it's basically a woman going through stuff. So you're back in Los Angeles. Mm-hmm. Uh, I know you've, you've written here a bit in the past. Yeah. How does it feel to be back? Um, weirdly nice. Like I, I love it here, but I also, um, after a bit, I, I'm ready to kind of go uh, home and be a northerner. Um, whilst I'm here, I feel like I'm a northerner pre- pretending not to be a northerner. Um, so yeah, it's nice to be back and like get some sun on my skin and, mm-hmm. um, yeah, it's nice in doses. And you've worked uh, <laughs> on music here. Who do you like working with here in Los Angeles? Um, my kind of go-to person is um, Tim Anderson, who did a lot of the Solange stuff and Banks and stuff like that. Um, he's my favorite person to work with uh, in America. Um, and he's introduced me to some amazing people, actually. I've been working with Rabel, who mm-hmm. uh, we wrote Hey Lover together with. Um, and just anybody a part of his team, like he's got a guy called Sir Dylan, who um, is an amazing producer who actually helped produce a Boyfriend. And anybody he brings in, I kind of, they're automatically like my favorite people because he's, they're all like-minded. So um, yeah, he's like my kind of, my favorite, 100%. So yeah, for the rest of the year, what, what's, what else is on the agenda? <laughs> so I have a EP coming out in May um, and also, some shows uh, happening in Europe, um, one happening in London on the 28th of May, um, and then some more in Paris and Amsterdam and Berlin. Wonderful. What can yeah. we expect from the EP? 
I don't know, really. It's 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 a lot of the songs are quite different. Um, none of them are really the same. I don't think. Um, it's really personal, like a lot of stuff that people do is always really personal. But I think it's the most personal I've been, um, and it's kind of just uh, it's raw. I think. Um, yeah, it's just good tunes. <laughs> Perfect. Well, we, we we love your music very much. So definitely check out Charlotte's music. The newest single is Boyfriend. Check it out now. And thank you so much for performing for us as well. Thank you. Charlotte OC on We Found Your Music at Dash Radio.